Any time a new entry is added to the list of astronomical discoveries, the real work begins. From then on, it is up to researchers to decipher the background, the causes, and the basic characteristics of the galactic find. This is a very demanding task, and one that doesn't always lead to revealing findings. On the contrary, many objects and structures that are newly added to the star maps initially come off as great mysteries. But it's precisely those mysteries that are of immeasurable value to the scientific community. Only if we uncover and unravel hitherto unknown processes and structures of the universe can we add further pieces of the mosaic to the overall picture of the cosmos. Even the enormous explosion that researchers recently identified in the gigantic expanse of space is still waiting to be fully unraveled. What the astronomers have been able to find out so far about this violent event, and which discovery made scientific headlines in addition, we reveal to you now. Want to find out more about the exciting discoveries and fascinating spectacles in the universe on a regular basis? Then remember to subscribe to Simply Space and click on the bell to stay up to date from now on. Show us with a thumbs up that we can keep you engaged with the content of our posts. Mysterious Explosion the astronomical world is once again faced with an exciting mystery. Recently, scientists observed a huge explosion originating at a distance of around 130 million light years. However, this was by no means the first time that the corresponding region of the cosmos came into the researchers' sights. Previously, the experts had succeeded in identifying the violent collision of two neutron stars there. These compact stellar remnants are among the densest objects in the universe and are known above all for their insane self-rotation speed. The current record holder, which was discovered in 2004, even reaches 716 revolutions per second. When the two neutron stars merged, they released an enormous stream of energy that gradually began to subside. About three and a half years later, however, astronomers encountered something new at that very spot the exact background of which has yet to be determined. Surprisingly, the experts registered another explosion there, which was accompanied by a release of energy of unimagined proportions. Ido Berger, a professor of astronomy at the renowned Harvard University and part of the research team that became aware of this event, described the spectacle as astonishingly intense. Meanwhile, the fact that we know about the existence of this exciting phenomenon is thanks to the use of the Chandra X-ray Observatory. Even if the exact background of the brutal explosion cannot yet be clearly assigned, the researchers consider two scenarios to be probable. On the one hand, it could be a so-called kilonova glow. Experts understand the term kilonova to mean a burst of brightness that has its origin in the fusion of a binary star. The electromagnetic radiation of such an event is fueled by the radioactive decay of elements. In terms of intensity, a kilonova ranks between a classical nova and a supernova. Astronomers suspect that such eruptions have had an important influence on the development of the universe and terrestrial life. Accordingly, some experts believe that elements such as gold and platinum were formed during such explosive stellar mergers. After the kilonova, the debris may have been hurled into space where it in turn created an enormous shockwave. This process heated up everything in its immediate vicinity. So, you could say the discovery was the stunning afterglow of a gigantic explosion. The other theory of the background of the new discovery is based on the influence of a black hole. In detail, the fusion of neutron stars could have led to the birth of a stellar black hole. These gravity monsters are among the most extreme formations in the cosmos. As a result of their incomparable compactness, these monsters of mass turn into cosmic omnivores. Nothing that has passed the event horizon of a black hole can cross it again from the inside out. Although these astronomical objects are invisible to our research eye, they nevertheless reveal their existence through the matter they devour. Due to the extreme acceleration 
The matter that crashes into a black hole heats up to millions of degrees. The characteristic glow that accompanies this process can in turn be registered by telescopes. In order to find out whether this exciting new discovery is a kilonova glow, or whether it is matter falling into a black hole, researchers will in the future focus on the nature of the light or radiation. If mainly radio emissions are detected, we are probably dealing with the consequences of a kilonova. If, however, scientists detect X-rays, it's likely that a black hole has its cosmic fingers in the pie. Gluttonous Mass Monsters We have already told you that black holes are appropriately called galactic omnivores. However, current research by experts shows just how unrestrained the hunger of these gravity monsters can be. The data collected indicate that in the densely populated star clusters of some galaxies, there are special black holes that destroy and consume hundreds of these dazzlingly bright celestial bodies in a very short time. Just as in the case of the discovery already presented, it was also thanks to the use of the Chandra X-ray Observatory that researchers became aware of this exciting characteristic. The discovery holds great potential for knowledge. Deciphering the information obtained could help us understand how so-called intermediate black holes are formed. The representatives of this subclass can have between 100 and 100,000 solar masses. For the researchers, these formations embody something like a missing link. Many stellar black holes with only a few solar masses have already been detected. Their supermassive counterparts, which exceed the mass of our host star by a factor of millions, or even billions, are now also found relatively often on stellar maps. On the other hand, those gravity monsters that fall between these two extremes in terms of their masses are all the rarer due to the scarcity of information. The background to the formation of intermediate black holes has always been overshadowed by many question marks. The Missing Link it's possible these objects embody the result of stellar collisions and mergers. The problem for researchers, however, is the fact that the current formation theories presuppose conditions that existed in this form only in the early phase of the cosmos. These include, among other things, the spontaneous collapse of large stars or dense gas clouds. Another thesis, however, is based on the assumption that medium-sized black holes can still be born today. In theory, this would be possible if several stellar black holes merged with each other. Moreover, it's conceivable that a stellar black hole could literally eat its way to a medium-sized black hole. This can be the case if the corresponding structure is surrounded by so many stars that it can fall into an unchecked feeding frenzy. In essence, this is a kind of interplay of attraction, gravitational turbulence, and tidal forces that is practically self-reinforcing. Conversely, such a process leads to thousands of stars plunging into the maw of a black hole in a relatively short time. But as always, even the most exciting theories of scientists have no significant value if they cannot be backed up with supportive data and observations. To find clues to the true existence of such voracious mass monsters, researchers looked for the characteristic X-ray radiation emitted by black holes during the annihilation of matter. In detail, the scientists focused their research on more than 100 small galaxies, looking in particular at their dense star clusters. Such clusters are made up of up to 10 million solar masses of stars, but they extend only a few light years across. Such circumstances would therefore provide the perfect conditions for voracious black holes. And indeed, the astronomers' commitment was soon to be crowned with success. In one of the galaxies studied, the researchers came across conspicuous X-ray emissions whose source was in the nuclear cluster. The results thus indicate that an active black hole is indeed hidden in the corresponding region, helping itself to its galactic neighbors to its heart's content. More detailed investigations finally showed a certain trend. The more densely populated a nuclear cluster is, the greater the probability that a growing black hole exists there. Conversely, this means that certain core star clusters fulfill the right conditions to serve as a breeding ground for a future intermediate black hole. The experts compared the processes that take place within such a scenario with a visit to a stellar buffet. Thus, it's possible for the gravity monster to attract many stars in a short time, 
tear them apart, and devour their matter. The Cradle of Black Holes Even though there are still some open questions to be answered and more data to be collected regarding this exciting theory, scientists are already optimistic. The information obtained so far suggests that dense nuclear clusters could indeed be the galactic cradles of medium-sized black holes. As the objects consume thousands or tens of thousands of stars, they consequently continue to grow. However, the feeding frenzy of the mass monsters will come to an end one day, when the black holes run out of stellar supplies. The researchers' current models show that this will happen around the time when the gravity monster weighs 1,000 solar masses. After that, it will move at a much more leisurely pace and supply itself from then on via classical accretion. In any case, we are eagerly awaiting the findings that the researchers will obtain in this regard. As soon as there is something new on this exciting topic, we will inform you. Now we need your opinion. What do you think about the exciting discoveries and theses that we have presented to you in today's video? As always, write us your thoughts, suggestions, and feedback on our contribution in the comments below. Finally, take a look at the other interesting contributions on our channel, which you can access by clicking on the images in the credits. Thanks for watching, take care, and we'll see you next time. See you next time.